all right so in this video i'll show you something about uh, this chevy express cargo van that uh sometimes it's kind of tricky um but it's good to know this uh it's about the fuse boxes in this chevy express cargo van this chevy express cargo van has uh two sets of fuse boxes because it has so many uh, electrical components that, that need these fuses i'll show you basically where you can find these fuse boxes which is tricky and it's kind of different in more in uh, than other vehicles you, uh, you have a fuse box that has things like uh, like uh, car interior lights radio all those kind of small small little stuff and the location of this fuse box is under the driver's seat so i'll show you you come here uh, when you look at the driver's side of the car you see the steering wheel is there so this is the driver's side of the car you come under the under the seat right under the seat look under the seat right here under the seat right under there and you'll see there's this box here with this cover here uh, uh, most of the time it's hard to, <laughs> to tell it's a fuse box until somebody tells you but it comes with this, this uh, you can see this is the cover for the fuse box it's kind of dusty but hey this is the cover of the fuse box and the way to open it you just follow uh, follow these arrows there's clips there's a clip on this side and a clip on this side you pull the you can see the arrow here and the arrow here you pull the clips and it opens up and inside the box it will tell you uh, where all these fuses go to like you can see there's a spare fuse you can see all these numbers one all the way to 34 the power window this it will tell you and if you look inside after you remove the cover you will see the fuses so this is just a cover but now you can see the fuses all those are fuses for this car and if you if you if you blow something like maybe you blow uh for example let's check number number seven number seven if you have power locks on number seven and you see your power locks do, uh, are not working so you check the fuse number seven if it's blown you, you change it with the same number of fuse you can see the numbers on the right that's the few those are the fuses for mostly the interior stuff of the car and if you look at this box it has all the information you need to know about uh, the interior of the car the, uh, the, you can see the like number 18 left uh, LT left hand rear parking light uh, trailer parking light all the all these numbers so those are the, mostly the interior fuses of the car then there is another fuse box I need to show you this car has two fuse boxes this fuse box is again on the driver's side, but as you can see, it's in the engine of the car. So you come here, you open the hood, you open the, the hood of the car, and the fuse box is right here under. This is the power steering. This is where you put your power steering fluid. This is where you put the brake fluid. Right under it. You, you see another box this is another box here and it has a cover too it has two clips as you can see if you look at that box it has two clips on, on, on both sides and you follow the arrows and you open the same way as the other box and if you if you move that uh, box look how many fuses you have here a lot of fuses a lot of fuses and if you look at this box here, the cover, this is the cover for the engine, for the engine fuse boxes. Look how many, uh, how much information you have on that box. All this, you need to read this. You need to read this. You can see things like uh, the battery, hazard lights, engine fuses, ignition, cranking. Uh, that means starting the car. Uh, for the car to crank lamps horn everything here so this is the interior the engine fuse box it's right there when you remove the cover that's what you see 
right there. So these are the two locations of the, few, uh, the two fuse boxes in this uh, Chevy Ex Express cargo van. It's, it's the same in most Chevy Express cargo vans. So most likely they'll be in the same locations. These Savannah, GM vans. So look, look for these two fuse boxes. And you can see this, this is a bigger cover. And it comes with some spare, it comes with some spare fuses in there. You can see spare fuses. And this is the interior fuse box, which is smaller, but you need to know the location of these two fuse boxes. So if you have any questions, you can ask there in the comment section. And uh, I hope this is of some help to you. And uh, um, let me know. And you're welcome to subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. And hope you have a good day. Thank you.